So in front of 19,000 fans on a stinking hot day, the Sri Lankans needed a total of 324. That was an asking rate of 6.48 and over to secure what you would have to say is uh, an improbable victory. Ah! Big appeal there for LBW. has gone. First ball, McCurdy has struck. So out for Duck, and it's one for three. That's a beautiful shot. He really is a very elegant stroke maker. You can't beat that for a cover drive. There are three men saving one on the offside, and Aravind De Silva has hit it straight through the gap. Well, that didn't bounce at all. He's given him out, going for the pull shot. The ball didn't bounce at all, and Aravind De Silva trapped plum LBW. Expected. It's in the air, and he's gone. He's out. Well, that's very well bowled by McCurdy. A shorter ball there. Arjuna oh, Renatunga couldn't get out of the way quickly enough. It hit him on the glove and went straight up in the air. So three for 14. This match is evaporating into the afternoon heat. And the call for catch it. And the call has been answered brilliantly. 23. In the air. And it'll be caught by David Boone at cover. And the, re the wheels have really fallen off the Sri Lankan cricket team. Will it mean this attempting to hit that through mid wicket? Hogged Garanane. In the air, and Dean Jones gets a hand to it, but he can't hang on to it. Simon O'Donnell to Margella. Runs off Simon O'Donnell. And a long chase for the man down at third man. Rodney Hogg is down there. It's 5 for 35 in 15. There's a nice stroke from Madagala. Three runs to Madagala. We're just coming out of their shell. It's not far away. Yes, as well bowled. It was a slower ball. A good slow Yorker. Hog to Ratnayaka. In the air, someone running back. This is a difficult catch. And he takes it and takes it well. Vessels to Karanane. Right cut. The sweeper is Steve Smith. Return so they've passed the lowest score in the competition that was 63 by India versus Australia and Sydney in 1980-81. That's in the air, he's under it at point and he departs and the silver's out for six. A couple of vessels continues, Norton John on strike, goes for the big hit, it's in the air, it finds a gap at long on. One of the few boundaries not a boundary, it's suckered along by, by Hogg, and they run three. Well, a bit of by play in the outfield, saves a run. Australians are very generous, and there's a tragedy about I'm sure this will be no obsession as the ball goes up, and it's Hogg coming in very slowly. He gets it. Wow, he fell into that one. He had the stumbles, but Rodney Hogg kept his eye on the ball. A pause from Dean Jones, but if ever there was a fruit, that was one. He was stumbling and struggling, and the Rodney Hogg ageing now in the early 30s took a fine catch. It wasn't a bad move to give Kepler Vessels a couple of overs. Runs fine. Simon O'Donnell giving chase. Should be three in it. 91 in this. 36th over. Sri Lankans haven't scored three runs and over. They're waiting for the kill. And then we got it, they've got it. That's it, he's stumped. Granville de Silva stumped. Phillips, bold vessels for seven. They're all out for 91. A victory by 232 runs.